What is up, my crazy subscriber? This is Joking John 74, and today we're going to be talking about Black Ops 3 vs. Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. Now, we all know Call of Duty Advanced Warfare, Black Ops 3, and Call of Duty Ghost are in the bottom of the barrel. They are the worst of the series. Nobody wanted some Halo bullshit. Nobody wanted Call of Duty Ghost because it really did not have a UAV, and the connection was terrible, and the sound effects were terrible, and the kill streaks were worse, and everybody would fucking camp because there's no spy plane. There was like a lot of problems with Call of Duty Ghost. And do not tell me right now that Call of Duty Ghost got better for you because you went back for it because of Advanced Warfare, blah, blah. No, I'm talking about that one year cycle. Call of Duty Ghost is the worst of the worst because. It made YouTubers quit. It made myself quit. It made uh, Woody's Gamertag quit. Even himself. He went to Minecraft and sued some kid after that. So, um, yeah, it made YouTubers quit. And a lot of people did not play it in that one year cycle. So you cannot say Call of Duty Ghost has gotten better right now. So anyways, so now for the runner-up position for the worst of the worst, Call of Duty Advanced Warfare and Black Ops 3. So how can Black Ops 3 not look as bad as Call of Duty Advanced Warfare? Well... Let me tell you this right now. In my past two months, my last two months experience with Call of Duty Advanced Warfare, I can tell you this. There's a very few weapon selection in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. There is. There's not a lot of selection. Every single category, they have only one functional weapon. The bow, the ASM-1, the Ameli, and a pump action shotgun, I believe. I think it's a pulse shotgun. It shoots air and it can kill you like it was one shot. If you're like at least like seven feet away from the enemy and closer so it's insane that gun is actually pretty good um another weapon will be the ohm but i'm pretty sure that weapon's gonna get updated and then it's gonna suck ass so uh, i don't expect the ohm so i can just say like there's like around four to five weapons functional in call of duty advanced warfare out of the many they have maybe they have like around 30 weapons and only four are functional are you serious are you, i mean i remember modern warfare 3 and black ops 1 having more than three weapons per category functional Black Ops 1, I can name you some. Galil, Vamas, and the, uh, what was the other one? The AK, the Commando. Damn, that's not really like four fucking weapons in one category. God damn. You see how balanced the weapons are in that game compared to the ones in Advanced Warfare? Seriously, they, ha they even have a three-round burst SMG. What the fuck? Seriously? Who came up with that fucking gun? That has to be the dumbest fucking gun i ever seen, especially on the SMG division. SMG, three-round burst. Wow, I'm going to use it. Cause it's fucking good. Fuck no, man. That shit rattles a lot. It's worst. I prefer it on the assault rifle, not an SMG. So, anyways, yeah, the weapon selection is not that much in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. So the only way Black Ops Three can look good and be on top of Call of Duty Advanced Warfare is by having more weapon selection, more gun balancing, making each and one, uh, each and single weapon uh, usable in the game. So, um, yeah, that's the only way. That's the only way I can change my mind about Black Ops 3. I'll say like, yeah, you know what? It's better than Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. There's more weapon selections. I can work with this. I can work with best class setups, work on some other weapon and shit. Like, I can just say it. Like, yeah, I'll give the game a C plus or something. You know, because right now I have like a D minus on Black Ops 3. But if they do have more weapon selection, I'll give it a higher grade. And maybe I'll change my mind about Black Ops 3. Because if you guys saw my little rant that I did, like my very first video that I talked about Black Ops 3 after the trailer, you know, it was pretty much of a negative one. <laughs> and a lot of people didn't like it. So, uh, anyways, yeah, that's my point, guys, that uh, Black Ops 3 can only be better than Call of Duty Advanced Warfare by having more weapon selection. Make it like around three weapons per category. You know, three assault rifles, three SMGs that are pretty much usable you can customize it to whatever you like and they are able to they are capable to compete against each other you know because you can go to any pro right now you can go to any youtube right now and see they're only using the bow asm1 the ameli uh, the pole shotgun and the ohm only five fucking weapons in call of duty advanced warfare so that is it subscribe for more you guys want to see more black ops 3 topics and also more black ops 3 news there's gonna be more stuff that i'll be showing you guys more score streaks more uh, more breakdown of the trailer and um, I'll be pointing out stuff that people did not see. So I'll, I'll see you guys later and subscribe for more Black Ops 3.